Hello there, everyone. We're going up. Stupid. Not going up the down escalator. Going up to the 60th floor. Yes. Every reactor, every pillar. Like I said, a full inspection. There's no telling what kind of damage there might be. If you see anything, anything out of the ordinary, I want to know. <sighs> Sorry to bother you, sir. No. It's fine. I've brought the damage assessment for Sector 7 you requested. Sir, perhaps <laughs> you should try and get some sleep. No, not yet. I need to finish preparing my draft of the reconstruction plan before tonight's board meeting. <sighs> Whatever reasons they might have had, destroying an entire sector is... it's beyond the pale. Director, I would strongly advise you not to say such things outside of this room. <sighs> Don't I know it. Got him. He literally objected to it, I think. No wonder he doesn't want it. It's kind of what objection. Memorial Hall. All right, give me item. Welcome to the Shinra Building, our humble home. Oh, hell no! Here, in the Memorial Museum, you can learn all about our president, as well as the various divisions that make up the company. And, of course, the city of Midgar, and the miracle of Mako Energy. Whatever takes your fancy, you're sure to learn something new. Yeah, yeah, shut up! Is there anything else out here? Gotta be thorough. Elevator. What's up, elevator? Okay, there wasn't. Really? I already went in there. So let me go back in. Guns. I think I just threw up a little. The Shinra developed guns. Very highly of himself. Wait, can I actually learn things? Oh, uh, these are the cigars the president smoked. This is a handgun the president shot someone with. This is a baby casket. Uh, someone died. Thank you for taking our tour. Hey, Super duper cool. What's up? Weird dominatrix. Can I go? Can I go? Keep talking or let me leave! Ah, the Elite Four. By giving you a closer look at each of our divisions. I hope you're ready to be amazed, because you simply won't believe all the exciting adventures we have here. These all look so familiar. Because we've destroyed a bunch of them already. Uh, these are people and robots. Which I have uh, fought all. All right, we took care of the first Elite Four awesome. member. I hope you enjoyed learning about our divisions and the wonderful ideas no! that are produced to benefit us all. Here at Shinra, we strive to ensure the safety of all residents around the clock. Uh-huh.
This is a lot of walking. Just let me go. If I want to watch it, let me watch it. We'll teach you all about the miracle of Mako energy and our reactors, as well as the city of Midgar itself. So come on. This is Midgar, our home, recreated in one ten thousandth scale. As you can see here. The eight Mako reactors form a ring around the center of our city and keep Midgar running day and night. The Mako which flows beneath our feet is a truly limitless resource. At Shinra, we have developed technologies to extract it and transform it into the fuel and electricity that powers everything we do. Thanks to the miracle of Mako energy, our lives are richer and better than ever before. Mako keeps our lights on at night and made Midgar into the city that never sleeps. A triumph of technology and testament to man's potential. Nothing but a bunch of lies. Except that Mako has made people's lives better. It's made people blind. Blind to the cold hard truth. Even I used to bind to their bullshit. Remembering that makes me even madder. Yeah, I won't get into this very much. I'll be a quick statement about, like, environmentalism with, like, some of the stuff that's going on. I think something probably needs to be done shutting down 100% of our infrastructure. Not a very smart way of doing it. Congratulations! You can call yourself a proud Shinra scholar! Now, moving along, next you'll learn about our progress in advanced science and technology. Please proceed to the 61st floor, the Visual Entertainment Hall. I know that there's a little bit of, uh, to the visual entertainment hall, where issues with that going Shinra's around. Edge technology. Through an immersive visual and audio experience, please relax and enjoy the show. Please stay and enjoy the show. No! Oh, watch your stupid show. Yeah, I don't know. Just some of the, like, things need to be done. We need to be environmentally conscious. But uh, some of the plans I've heard are fucking stupid. It's like, but what if we made gasoline three times as expensive? That'll help the everyday person. What? No! So it, it was stuff like that. This place is empty. I'm no expert, so I won't get into it. I just... I want something good being done if something is going to be done. Period. Like, no matter what the situation is, really. This is Earth. In the distant past, our planet was home to a people we call the Ancients. Many millennia before we discovered Mako, these precursors were already pioneering its use. Somehow they learned of the great reservoir of energy pulsing beneath their feet. And once they had, the ancients developed the means to harness this bountiful energy and bend it to their will. Ah, energy benders. The fruits of their labors have survived to this very day in the form of certain kinds of materia. Their scripture, too, has endured. We who are born of the planet, with her we speak, her flesh we shape. Uh, is that Leviathan? Her promised land shall we one day return. By her loving grace and providence, may we take our place in paradise. 
Alas, the ancients themselves are long gone. 2,000 years ago, a meteor brought an end to their civilization. But before their fiery end, did the ancients find their promised land? Even now, we have only to wonder. Times have changed, and the Shinra Electric Power Company is committed to changing and evolving with them. Like the ancients, we have harnessed the power of Mako. Are they out there watching us? Waiting for us to join them in some blessed corner of the world. A green and verdant land where boundless Mako energy will provide for our every need. Shinra is working for you to fulfill the hope of the ancients and lead us to that promised land. We shall not rest until our dream is realized. Sephiroth. Oh dear. Oh dear. A man of my refined taste running out of butter. <laughs> Short of its proper accompaniment, this tea might as well be boiled pond water. <laughs> huh? Huh? The hell puts butter in tea? Possibly have been Sephiroth. Crazy ass thing made me want to puke. And not just because of the presentation, but the content too. Ought to come with a warning. That ain't for kids. That wasn't just a movie. That huge meteor. What was that about? Like I said, nothing you should show a kid. Alright. Let's go. Congratulations! You can call yourself a proud Shinra expert. Your mission is to go out and tell everyone about the wonders of Shinra. Next, you'll be visiting the repository for Shinra's expertise and know-how. Please make your way to the 62nd floor, the corporate archive. What the? What's up? You have a very weird oh. goatee. Greetings and welcome. Avalanche, I presume. My name is Hart, and it's a pleasure to meet you. Neat. Hmm? I've come to escort you to Mayor Domino, per his request. The mayor of Midgar? The empty suit that's just a mouthpiece for Shinra? The very same. Yes. <laughs> the mayor of our dear Midgar. The most magnificent city ever built. That Mayor Domino. The Visual Entertainment Hall has been experiencing technical difficulties of late, and he suspected that these difficulties might impede your progress. So what does the mayor want with us? I'm afraid you'll have to ask him that yourself. You mean we don't get to go through two yes, more rooms of to fun follow. thing? Hmm. Can you update my key card? Why would you? I just realized his pants are green. Why would you wear green pants? And a... What, what, what color is that? Beige? I don't know. White? Look at this place. Gray? Looks terrible. <gasps> Robots! So what? You telling me the mayor's some kind of crazy bookworm?
Look, you always need a secret entrance. If you ever can custom build a house, put a secret entrance in that shit. If you don't, I think you might just be a racist. Through here. If this is a trap, you're a dead man, you hear? But it could be items. The mayor is waiting. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. I'll explore. All right, we'll just go in. <sighs> this can't be right. Ah, wonderful. You finally made it. <gasps> hey. I am the mayor of the great metropolis of Mako. Domino, at your service. <laughs> I must say you three haven't exactly been discreet. Not particularly. Huh? I wonder who's been cleaning up all your messes. What the hell's going on? Come on, think about it. You've been caught by security several times, walked in front of every other camera, <laughs> and scared an accountant half to death. Do you hear the alarm? No? You're welcome. <sighs> hmm. I can only assume your cell wasn't looped in. I am Avalanche's man on the inside. Say what? Huh. Is it really that surprising to you? You've seen where they put me. The mayor of the greatest city in the whole wide world, tucked away in a secret broom closet in the damned archives. The nerve. Those stupid Shinra pricks thought I'd just shut up and accept their treatment. But they were wrong. Dead wrong. Huh. Well, this ought to make things easier. We need to break into Professor Hojo's lab. What? Why? You mean you're not here to give President Shinra his comeuppance? We're here to save a friend who was taken. But the president's going to get his, too, if I have anything to say about it. <clears throat> well, I don't particularly care what you end up doing, so long as it hurts Shinra. Great. So, I can get you as far as the 64th floor. Hold up. You're telling me that that's the best you can do? That is indeed the best that I can do. But you're the mayor. But you're the mayor? Does <laughs> this look like the office of a mayor? I'm a glorified librarian. Nothing more. They don't even invite me to their meetings. Sorting records and reports. That's all I do. My hands and fingers have more paper cuts than skin. No one knows my pain, my daily torment. <laughs> they made me a pathetic shell of a man. Uh, uh, okay, they did you wrong like us, but we'll make it right. So just calm down. <laughs> Deep breaths, man. Deep breaths. I like the mayor. He's mm. funny. Let me see that key card of yours. Here you are. You can now use it to access the recreational facility on the 63rd floor. And then what are we supposed to do? You look for a fellow Avalanche collaborator. Identify yourselves and he'll give you a key card to the 64th. The countersign is... The mayor is the best! Midgar's mayor is nothing less! Everyone says he's cooler than the rest. <laughs> <laughs> Just say mayor to the guy. And if he goes the best with gusto, then you found your man. <laughs> you got it? <laughs> I love the mayor. <laughs> if you think you found the collaborator, say, May You got it now? <laughs> <laughs> You're fantastic, man. Oh, uh, I love you. 
Hey, do you have weapons? Are you the collaborator? If you require additional assistance, please. So can you tell us anything about this collaborator? Certainly, I could do just that. But a man in my position must conduct his affairs with discretion. Which is to say that that which has been requested cannot be freely given, if you take my meaning. You want money! Disclosing confidential information entails considerable risk. Do you come in this particular instance? That would amount to 10,000. Rip us off more, why don't you? Sure. The 64th floor is reserved for our executives. The individual you seek is fastidious and well-dressed. This individual likes to visit the 63rd floor to decompress from the stress of the job. That really all you got for us? Oh, are you dissatisfied with your purchase? How unfortunate. Perhaps this will help preserve our relationship. Huh? I got gun. An expression of my gratitude and appreciation. Huh. That's better. Sweet. How's this gun? Uh, let's go. Upgrade. Uh, Barat. Farm who's actually is dependent on the wheeler's emotional state. Okay. Could some all ATB gauge to deliver a close range blast. Uh, seems okay. We're gonna check the weapon regardless. Just doesn't seem amazing. Materia. 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 I know that was a connected. I don't care. And another connect. That's fine. Um, what do we got? HP. Um, we want to go with HP again. Nope, that's not HP. Um, and then we had, what was this, like 5% attack damage for basic attacks, which is legitimately terrible, but do it anyway. Don't care about low HP things. Let's go with a um, attack power up, magic attack power up. Go with the magic up. Where is it? And critical hit damage boost, overcharge damage boost, don't care. Critical hit rate up is pretty good. Damage or rate? We want rate. Alright, neat. That's pretty good. It's got an extra slot. It's a balanced weapon, and it can shoot. Which is good enough for me. So we'll go... Uh, minus 1200 HP. That's a lot of HP to lose for just magic and one materia slot. Uh, what is that even worth it it's a new it's a new uh weapon so yeah it's worth it give an hp up we do and this is on one of his other pieces of equipment so might as well give it to him. Because that gave... Hold on, let's... How much should it give? It was 10%. It should be 600. Why is it only 400? That's weird. It only gives 400. It doesn't have, like, a lot of 
whatever. Um, don't care about Aerith still. All right, awesome. I still can't believe the mayor is working with Avalanche. Would have been nice to know. Idiots at HQ should have kept us in the loop. We get 3,000 gil. Uh, did we almost get 10,000 just being in here? I think we did. Go on. Okay. Is there an item in here? It doesn't appear there's an item in here. But maybe there's an item on the outside. It's worth checking. Uh, no, not that one. Give me back my map. I don't know if I'm the dumb dumb who keeps turning off my map. Stop turning it off. Nothing. Nothing really matters. Anyone can see. Nothing really matters. Nothing really matters. Me. So, so Pojo. about this precious promised land of yours. Come now, Aerith. You misunderstand my intentions. I wish only to satisfy their material greed so I can be left to pursue my great work. Our great work. My dear. Oh, his face. Hmm. You're the spitting image of her now. <laughs> Lucrezia. I regret it to this day. If she had only trusted me instead of trying to run, it could have played out quite differently. What a terrible tragedy to lose the last of the pure-blooded ancients. Though not completely, would you like to see your mother? Albeit through the lens of one of my microscopes. Did you really think we'd leave such a precious specimen to rot in the gutter? We collected and cataloged every last bit of her. Hair, skin, organs, every fragment of every bone. As breathtaking in death as in life. As you, my dear, if Valna was elegance, right down to her cellular structure. <laughs> and there it is, that same elegance. Oh, yes. Time for you. Oh, the microwave. Um, I get some popcorn for this freak Sit show. Back. I won't be long. Also, Lucrezia is, uh, which I'm pretty sure I'm butchering the name of, is something from later in the game. Involves one of the hidden characters, which I really want to see in this game. The 63rd floor. I mean, they're not in this game. Employees, relax and recharge. But I want to make sure that they're in it. But I bet people are still here dealing with the aftermath of Sector 7. It's their own damn fault. Stay focused. We need to find this guy. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Is it you? Guess I better get working on my conversation skills. Is it you? Is it you? Is it you? No? Okay, bye. Uh. Wait, is it supposed to be on this floor? Yeah, probably. This is a friggin' door right here. Fuck. Come on! <laughs> I hate these doors. <laughs> they need to be a little more forgiving. They look busy. The plate did just fall. What kind of particular to you? Seeing them like this somehow makes me feel a little bit better. Support is getting overwhelmed by calls. We'll have to resort to AI operators. 
Let's find our contact. Not seeing any security around. One less thing to worry about. It's truly a miracle there's no security around. A guy with a gun for an arm is walking around. Okay. Uh, Hail Hydra. Where are you? Hail, Hail Hydra. I think we just need to start talking to people who look the part. Remember, say mayor. If they say the best, Hail Hydra. We'll have a winner. Hail Hydra. Better catch up soon. Hail Hydra. Hail Hydra. Hail Hydra. Today we welcome a special guest, Shinra's Director of Public Security, who has an important message to share with us. <clears throat> Everyone here at Shinra is deeply saddened and outraged by this unconscionable act of terrorism, but at the same time we will not be cowed by threats or violence. To the people of Midgar, I make this vow. We will find the villains responsible and bring them to justice. Are you listening, Avalanche? You cowardly dogs! Run all you like. Shinra is coming. Do you think the other plates are in danger? Is it true that Wu Tai is gonna attack us again? We should be safe. Hell Hydra. Right? Hell Hydra? No, I'm gonna be here a while longer. The mayor. Hey, shush. I'm on the phone. Oh, but Hail Hydra. <gasps> Hail Hydra? <laughs> Imagine going in someplace and some freaks knocking over every chair. <laughs> uh. Hello, upper floor. Combat sim. You can use it to train for battle in a virtual space. Does training in that thing really make you better? We'll find out in the next episode if it does. Oh! Alright, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye! <laughs>